Hi, I'm here today to show you how easy it is to hook up and install your basement washdog Wi-Fi module. You will need four things to do so. A small flathead screwdriver, your Wi-Fi network name, your Wi-Fi network password, and a Wi-Fi capable device such as a smartphone, a laptop, or a tablet. What's included with your basement watchdog Wi-Fi module? The data port cable, the USB cable and charger, the remote terminal cable, the 12 volt battery cable, and mounting hardware. If you are attaching to an older watchdog special or big dog, you will not have a USB port on the side of your control box. You will be connecting to the Wi-Fi module using the remote terminal cable and the remote terminal on the side or back of the unit. Attaching to a big dog or special with the remote terminal. Using the remote terminal cable, attach one end of the cable labeled NO, normally open, to the normally open port of the remote terminal on the back of the big dog or the side of the special. Now attach the end labeled COM, common, to the common port of the remote terminal. Next, we will do the same thing at the Wi-Fi module. Please make sure the wires are in the proper ports. Now we're going to plug our Wi-Fi module into power. Taking the USB charger and the USB charger cord, plug it into your AC power. Take the mini end, plug it into the bottom port on the Wi-Fi module labeled 5 volt DC power. The last thing we need to do in attaching the module to your system is to provide backup power in case of a power outage. Using the battery cable, attach the large ring lug labeled positive on the red wire to the positive post of the battery on your backup system. Next, attach the smaller ring lug on the black wire to the negative post of the battery. Lastly, plug the power jack at the other end of the wire into the battery port on the bottom of the module. Now that the red and green lights are alternating, your module is ready for setup. Using your Wi-Fi capable device, open the Wi-Fi list in Network Settings. Select Glentron. This is the network being broadcast by the module itself. Please wait for a successful connection. Then go ahead and close your network settings open up your internet browser. In the URL field at the top, type in 192.168.1.1. This will take you to the Wi-Fi module setup page. If necessary, scroll down to fill out the information on the page. Hit Save. Scroll down and click on the Available Networks button. Select your network from the drop-down list and correctly enter your password. Click OK. If the connection is successful, the red and green lights on the module will stop alternating and the green light will become solid. This means the connection is successful. In a few short minutes, you will receive an email from glentronicsconnect.com at the provided email address. This email will include the temporary password you will need to complete the registration. Click on the Complete Registration link and it will take you to the Glentronics Connect website. This page will contain all the information you entered previously. Input your temporary password and click continue. This will complete your registration process. Once your registration is finished, we recommend you go back into the account and change your temporary password to one that you're going to remember. We also recommend that you test the setup. You can find out how to do this in your manual. The setup of your basement washed up Wi-Fi module is now complete and will give you peace of mind while away from home. 